Hello everybody, James Teacher here from Joule, and today we're going to talk about two really important ideas, democracy and autocracy. Now, first of all, let's give some definitions, okay? So democracy basically means when people are free to choose who becomes the president or the leader of the country. Autocracy is very, very, very different. Autocracy is when one person or one group of people decide everything and the people in that country are not free to choose. So let's look at some examples. Well, a great example of a democracy is the most democratic country in the world, which is where my ancestors came from long, long ago. <laughs> God help us. I don't think he can. Norway. Now, this is really strange because Norway, of course, is famous because it's where Vikings came from. Northmen, many, many, many years ago with horns on the... No, they didn't. They didn't wear horns on their helmets. But now, these days, Norway is incredibly, incredibly democratic and people are free to choose who they want to be the leader of the nation. Now, the opposite, remember, is autocracy. Now, the most autocratic country in the world is North Korea. Now, why is it so incredibly autocratic? Well, simply, People cannot choose anything. They have no choice. They have no decisions to make about the country. The leaders of the country decide everything. So it is an autocracy, something called an authoritarian autocracy. I live in an autocracy, if you can believe it, because there was one person who decides everything I have to do. Wake up at 6 a.m., James teacher, do the washing up, do the dishes, clean the clothes, clean the toilet. And that person is a dictator. And we call him Youngian the Dictator. This is the dictator in my house. He tells me to do everything and he is evil and he is powerful. And you should never, ever do anything wrong because he punishes you. Isn't that right? 